Well, it didn't take long for the recently resurrected Live 105 to bring back one of its classic specialty shows. Soundcheck. It's officially back and the music show runs from 8 to 10 p.m. on Sundays and serves as a platform for new music discovery. So joining us right now to talk about it is Live 105 DJ Aaron Axelson. Hello. How are you? Thanks for being here. Hey, hi. hi. Thanks for having me. Absolutely. Okay, well, first, I want to get your reaction. How does it feel to a, have Live 105 back and sound check? It's um, it's just it's mind blowing to me. I'm, I'm still kind of in shock, but it's a big win for for the Bay Area uh, music scene. Um, Live 105 is such an important brand, and uh, it was kind of sad it was gone for so many years. But um, it represents such a passionate music community that was kind of being unserved for for many years. So I'm thrilled that Odyssey SF brought uh, Live 105 back and me. And, and the sound check show. Yes, having you back too is a vital part of that as well. So glad to have that you're back too. Okay, so you're right. Sound check is a vital open door for artists. Let's just go through some of the examples. Billie Eilish, Gorillaz, The Killers, so many more. Aaron, we know sound check came online this Sunday. What are some of the standouts? What are some of the new music that you're playing that you think are going to be the next big emerging artists? Oh, that, that's a tough question to put me on the spot. There's a, a band from England that we're, we've been championing um, called uh, Lovejoy that just sold out bimbos. That's a big part of, of uh, the new um, sound check movement. That's funny, that's a, that's a picture of me right there with Daft Punk. <laughs> and there's the Beastie Boys from a BFD back in the day. Um, but yeah, sound checks always kind of served as a platform for new music discovery. Imagine Dragons, Arcade Fire, The Strokes, My Chemical Romance all debuted on the show. And it's also an important voice for the local music scene. It's a, it's a platform, an outlet for Bay Area bands to get played on the radio. And, and you know, and I think, I don't know if you agree with me, but the music scene here has changed a lot in the last few years. I know COVID, but even before that, just sort of where bands are playing and how you can go see them live. I would love to hear more about local bands and bringing those live venues and element back. Is this something that maybe Live 105 will tap into now that you're back? You know, absolutely, 100%. It's always been live music, concerts, has been a, a vital component of Live 105's fabric since it launched in 1986. Um, I know I was talking to a lot of big concert promoters like Another Planet, Golden Voice, Live Nation, and they are all thrilled that Live 105 is coming back because they, they mentioned that ticket sales for alternative rock shows over the last three or four years were down significantly. So Live 105 plays a big part of that and promoting live music as well as um, concerts and events. And so yeah, it, it's a big win again for everyone that loves go into shows and live music. Um, it's just, I'm just thrilled that, that we're back. I am too, and someone who's married to a musician, he is too. I have about 30 seconds left. I'm a former radio DJ. I love the feeling of cracking that mic and introing really great songs. What is the favorite song you've ever introed on the radio or had that moment you're like, this is gonna be big? Oh, you know what, I'll tell you what. I remember when I first debuted Mr. Brightside by The Killers off a demo that I had in 2003. The song now is a masked over a billion streams. I remember playing that on Soundcheck in 2003 on Live 105 with the first station to play that. And I knew at that moment that that song was gonna be absolutely massive. It was changing the musical pendulum, that song in particular. And um, I was happy to be a part of that and champion that song. You're a part of music history right there. That is awesome, Aaron. Thank you so much. Live 105 DJ Aaron Axelson will be listening. Have a great morning. Thank you so much for having me.